Hi everyone, this is Dr. Douglas Husbands. I'm an Institute for Functional Medicine certified practitioner, a doctor of chiropractic, and a certified clinical nutritionist. Today, I want to talk to you about the top seven foods for healing a leaky gut. In this video, I'm giving you my top seven suggested foods and, and why they help heal leaky gut. But first, I want to mention to you that to truly completely heal and repair a leaky gut, especially depending on how long you've had it, especially if you have manifestations, more advanced manifestations of leaky gut where you've gone into autoimmune conditions, such as a woman between about 20 and 60 years old who um, has uh, thyroid problems, which uh, oftentimes is autoimmune-induced thyroiditis. Um, then you will want to make sure that you see a functional medicine practitioner to truly heal because you don't want to try to do this on your own just through um, the foods. You want to make sure that you uh, get professional help um, when needed in a case like that. In a case like that, the functional medicine practitioner would do something called a, a, a 6R program. I'm just going to mention it here. We'll talk about it in other videos. But 6R program is reduce, remove, replace, re-inoculate, repair, and rebalance. So I'm just going to mention that here and look for the explanation of that in other videos. Um, so the top seven foods to heal leaky gut are my number one top recommended food is Beef bone broth. Why do I specifically say beef bone broth? Because the, uh, the amino acid content of beef and some other factors in beef, the collagen um, and some of the other factors, the, the other components um, better than chicken for healing a leaky gut, that is chicken bone broth. Chicken bone broth is good, don't get me wrong, but especially for healing up, uh, sealing that, that um, what should be tight junction lining uh, between the epithelial cells, as we've talked about in previous videos, um, beef bone broth is really, really good, and that can be, you can make it on this, uh, in, a, in a crock pot or my favorite, Instapot, uh, uh, on the stove yourself, or you can, there's some good stores that have some good organic beef bone broth, and just drink that daily, a couple of times a day, uh, about eight to 10 ounces a couple of times a day. Number one food for healing a leaky gut. Number two food for healing a leaky gut that I, I would recommend would be fermented vegetables, such as kimchi, um, sauerkraut, um, because what, ha what you wanna do is you wanna really nourish the bacteria and you want to do things that will increase the diversity, that is increase the different types of bacteria because research continually shows that it's the increased number and the diversity of the, the bugs in your gut, the, the microbiome, that those are the people that tend to be the healthiest. So number three top food for healing a leaky gut would be homemade goat's milk yogurt fermented about 24 to 29 hours. Why goat's milk yogurt? Well, you want to have um, a, the good lactobacillus content uh, in um, yogurt, but you do not want to have some of the more problematic um, proteins and components in cow, that you would in cow's milk yogurt. So goat's milk yogurt is generally a lot easier to digest for a lot of people. And why goat's milk, why, why yogurt? Because it, it contains those beneficial bacteria that you're having in the process, those fermented um, um, milk products that are very beneficial for increasing the diversity um, and number of the various bacteria in your gut. Number four top healing food for leaky gut that I'd recommend would be coconut oil. Just even just taking a, um, a teaspoon of coconut oil a day, really good, some really good fatty acids, um, lauric acid or monolauric acid in coconut oils and antibacterial, antiviral, and um, uh, anti-infective agent, really good um, components in coconut oil, really soothing and healing for that leaky gut lining. Number five top 
um, food for healing and leaky gut would be fatty fish such as wild salmon or wild sardines. The omega-3 fatty acids in th this fish really can calm down inflammation. And as a lot of us already know, the omega-3 fatty acids, which are really high um, inherently in the um, salmon and sardines, those, those fatty fish, and wild because you um, do not want to get farm raised because they tend to be higher in mercury. But those omega-3 fatty acids are really good as far as calming down inflammation uh, for not only leaky gut, but many other conditions too, including inflammatory bowel uh, disease. So my sixth top um, food for healing leaky gut that I would recommend would be pumpkin seeds. Yes, pumpkin seeds, organic of course. Now, why pumpkin seeds? Well, they're one of the highest sources of magnesium um, in foods that you can find. Magnesium deficiencies, many people are extremely deficient in magnesium, and magnesium is involved in 600 or so biochemical reactions uh, in the body that are very necessary. And also, it, they're very high in plant sterols, in particular, beta cystosterol, um, which has some really good um, not only hormone balancing properties, uh, anti-inflammatory properties, and some good healing properties. And also about, about um, um, pumpkin seeds, um, there's a 2012 China study that shows that when people who had tapeworms uh, uh, ate pumpkin seeds, that alone, um, uh, nine of 12 of the people in this study who did that alone uh, expelled the full tapeworms uh, in their GI tract. So, and also, um, so whether you do or do not have tapeworms, um, it, it's shown some research studies, not only that study, but other studies have shown that's been beneficial. I've recommended that for uh, some of the patients that I have found tapeworms in, and uh, along with other things, it's been really helpful. Um, so the, the seventh top food um, for uh, healing leaky gut would be grass-fed ghee. Now, ghee is really, it's clarified butter. Ghee is really high in a particular um, fatty acid called butyric acid. Research studies continually show that butyric acid is very healing and helpful for um, increasing our inherent butyrate levels in the gastrointestinal tract. And what research shows is that butyrate levels higher uh, tend to be beneficial in a healthy uh, gut lining, not only the small intestine um, for healing leaky gut, but also for the colon um, for um, prevention and lowering of uh, potential um, colon cancer or, or colitis. So those top seven foods for healing leaky gut are something I would really encourage you to use if you do find you have leaky gut um, and they're very beneficial. This is Dr. Douglas Husbands, diagnosing the undiagnosable and treating root causes. Thanks for watching.